If the supervolcano beneath Yellowstone National Park experiences another major eruption, the ash could spew thousands of miles across the United States, damaging buildings, killing crops and shutting down power plants. This would be a major disaster. These disturbances can be caused by small variations in the level of water seeping into the underground reservoir system or pressure in Yellowstone. National Park rangers were forced to close the section after the newly formed thermal feature erupted violently and covered the pavement with a mixture of superheated groundwater and mostly mineral deposits. Those deposited from hot springs are also geysers hasn't erupted in five years is warming and spewing boiling water another indication that the National Park's hydrothermal system is working strangely according to Michael Poland, research geophysicist and scientist in charge at the Yellowstone Volcanic Observatory, its activity apparently began on May 24. Live science posted via email to this hydrothermal system very dynamic. The only constant is creating pipe-like holes in the ground that connect to underground water. This reservoir is characterized by its geysers which are hot springs. When the water reaches boiling point, its temperature is caused by molten rock located several miles deep in the earth. The crustal pressure in the chamber increases pushing the servant upwards. War towards the remaining water surface started steaming and finally became strong enough to shoot an angry column of water into the sky, Old Faithful. The famous geyser is located close to Geyser Hill where there has been an increase in activity recently however after two weeks the riots started to subside there but there is still unease in the region this is calming Poland stated its characteristics the eruptions are not very frequent and there are more than 10,000 mud hot springs geysers and steam vents that emit gas and water. Yellowstone mud is home to the largest and densest concentration of thermal features in the world therefore Poland says this latest activity is unusual and Geyser Hill will likely return to normal, say what new features continue to operate sporadically in the National Park rangers may need to reroute changes small pressures may be the cause of local eruptions and temperature increases. You can think of this system as somewhat similar to the pipes in an old polish house in that it has a core and may contain a lot of mineral deposits and small changes in pressure in the system can cause leaks. Another reason for this nuisance may be additional water seeping into it. The basement got a lot of snow in Yellowstone last year so runoff means more water below the surface. Pollen says all these factors together can influence the behavior of geysers and hot spring systems and change over time. Pollen says the recent disruption is a reminder what we experience. A thermal disturbance occurred in September 2018 and resulted in a devastating eruption. including the unusual eruption of an earring geyser that ejected 80 coins covered in human waste in the 1930s, logs and specks of debris exploding onto the surrounding landscape. A 30-foot, 9M, jet of water billows out over time, 